Hi, I'm Andy. The team at KiwiCo loves pie. Sweet pie, savory pie, and especially the number pie. But we may have found a middle schooler that loves it even more than we do. Her name is Sadie and she's 12 years old. So I gotta ask, can you recite some, some digits of pie? Yeah. 3.14159265353598976923246264338327950288419716939999 Wow. It was on forever and I know 100 digits. 100. That's crazy. I think I can m maybe do 10, maybe. <laughs> How did you learn to memorize 100? Well, there was this pie place that said that anyone that could recite the first hundred digits got a free pie, um, but only on Pie Day, March 14th. And so I decided that I'd start writing down the digits with a permanent marker on my hand. Whoa, on your hand? But your hand is so small, you, I, there's no way you can fit a hundred digits. And I ate 20 at a time, and then every time I looked at my hand, they'd be there, so. I just remember them. And how long did it take you? Um, like a few weeks. Who knows more digits, you or your dad? Um, we both know 100. You guys sound like quite the pair. Can you introduce us to him? This is my dad, um, Jacob Arandas, and he's a physics professor at Harvard. What do you think of Sadie's enthusiastic embrace of pie, both the number and, <laughs> and the food? It was both wonderful to see Sadie so interested in something and, and setting up a challenge for herself. That was really great to see. Uh, at the same time, I also felt um, a little nervous because I realized I should probably also uh, help out and try to learn pie myself. It seemed like a, a huge challenge. And was it harder or easier than you were expecting? It was, it was easier than I had thought. Um, but it was easier because Sadie kept pointing out patterns in the digits. There's this memory trick where if you can take, uh, you know, a long sequence of things and you can break it up into smaller pieces where, you know, you can give some sort of meaning to the individual pieces, it doesn't seem like as big a, a, a challenge. And so when Sadie started pointing out these patterns and I started learning them, I found it was actually easier than I had thought. You obviously have such great depth and obviously a talent for teaching this stuff. Um, do you have, have advice for parents who might be interested in getting their kids interested in math? Yes, yes. If you want them to see why mathematics is worth their time and their interest, you, you need to think about mathematics in this way. Mathematics is fundamentally about exploration. It's about creativity. It's about looking for patterns in the world around us and you can do mathematics as soon as you can think of shapes or games. So getting kids involved in mathematical exploration from an early age uh, is, is something I would highly recommend. This is an opportunity to go on an adventure with your kids. You're both super inspiring. Thank you so much for taking the time to chat with us. And Sadie, keep it up.